today and welcome to today's construction class all right so having a look at the question we have before us today so the very first thing there is to what is to draw our horizontal line right after doing that so the next thing is to project a vertical line directly on top of that horizontal line okay i haven't done that so you can see that uh the circle at the bottom right hand corner yeah the circle is circle of diameter 30 that means radius 15. radius 15. okay i draw the full circle okay so take note of this the distance between this circle and the circle uh, directly above it is half of radius what radius 56 and half of radius 56 yeah which is that okay so on top of that i'm drawing the second circle but that particular circle its radius is what uh that's diameter 26 which is radius 13. radius 13. Okay, so there was a line drawn at angle 45 towards this area here. So I'm going to do that now also. Angle 45 degrees, all right. So, uh, and also there is a line there at angle 5 degrees, 5 degrees. So I'm going to measure 5 degrees with my protractor. Okay, the 5 degree is towards the bottom, from the horizontal line towards the bottom. That's what, that's the 5 degree. Okay, to now pick radius 12. Placing it here, radius 12. I'm going to draw the first arc here. Okay, then at this top here also with radius 12, radius 12. Okay, I haven't done that. I'm just going to pick my compass at the midpoint here down here draw the arc which joins them together then extend it to the other end here and draw the second arc all right that has been set up okay now let's keep joining together so towards the top here i'm having uh the bigger circle of radius was radius 20 radius 20 so i'm going to pick that now radius 20 here so i'm going to draw it out Line, radius 20. Okay, then towards this area, I'm having radius 20 here also. Radius 20 here. I'm going to draw it, turn it out. Okay, so the arc joining this circle and this circle together is an arc of what radius 20. And looking at it, it is what it is an external arc. It is an external. So you are going to use principle of what principle of addition, which is what 20 plus 20, and that gives us what that gives us 40. 20 plus 20 equals to 40. So I'm going to pick arc of radius 40, striking it out here, then placing the same arc of radius 40 here, then striking the second arc. Then having done that, then I place my what? My arc of radius 20 here, up to the point of intersection here. Then I'm going to what? Join the two arc. I'm going to join the two up. All right. So that area has been what has been settled. Has been settled. All right. So towards the uh bottom here. Towards the bottom here. So the bigger arc there is arc of radius what radius 20. So and this is radius 20. Placing it there. I'm going to draw my arc. So measuring 76, placing it at the midpoint here, joins both of them together here all right so that area is also what also settled all right next is at this bottom all right so the bigger circle here is radius what radius 24 so i'm going to pick my compass and measure radius 24. measuring radius 24 placing the compass here i'm going to what draw my circle all right after drawing my circle so the arc and the arc have been joined together by another arc of radius what Radio 76 and that is what that is an internal arc that is an internal arc so which is going to be what 
on the right hand side is going to be what? 76 minus 24. 76 minus 24 is what? It's 52. 52. So I'm going to measure 52. So with my mark 52 at the midpoint here, I'm going to what? Strike my first arc here. After striking my first arc, then 76 minus this arc is radius what? Radius 20. 76 minus 20 is what? It's 56. So I'm going to measure 56. Okay, this is my mark 56 here. Then I'm going to what? Strike the second arc. This is the point of intersection. Then I'm going to measure what? I'm going to measure 76. Okay, my mark 76 now to the point of intersection here. Then I'm going to draw the arc. So to get this final uh, area here, to get this final area here, so the arc that joins them together is arc of radius what? Radius 36. Arc of radius 36. Arc of radius 36, and it is an what? An external arc. So for the bottom part here, that is 36 plus 24. 36 plus 24 is, is 60. That is 60. So I'm going to measure 60. Then on this side, this arc is arc of radius, of radius 20. So 20 plus 36 is what is 56. So I'm going to measure 56. So measuring my 56, I'm going to place my compass here. And I'm going to strike on this axis also. Having done that, then I'm going to measure my radius what now? My radius 36. My radius 36. Then I'm going to what? Join the two arcs together. So as you can see, it's what it is perfect. It is perfect. All right, so that is that about this particular uh, problem on what on a curved pageant. So kindly ensure you share these videos with your friends who are in need. Then also ensure you subscribe on our YouTube channel and click the like button. Thank you.